Hello, my name is Gems, and today I'm going to be answering tarantula questions from Google. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to type in Google, uh, will a tarantula something, uh, what if a tarantula, any kind of most search questions that come up when it comes to tarantulas. And I will have the budgies just casually in the background as I do this. So the first one is, will a tarantula bite you? Yes, not all will. Most are kind of uh, run away and hide. Some will bite you and then ask questions later. Some will kick hairs first, but all tarantulas can bite. How likely it is depends on the species and how well that personality is, their behavior and stuff like that. So not always a guaranteed bite, but if you have a tarantula like a pokey, then it's more likely to happen. The next one is, will a tarantula bite kill you? No, not necessarily. That's not technically how that works. However, you may get a rash if you're allergic or anything of the sort. It may take you to the hospital. There's always different things where a tarantula could bite you, especially even just the hairs themselves, where they kick eradicating hairs. If you are allergic to those hairs, it could end up with you going to the hospital, especially if you get it in your lungs, like breathing it in. Otherwise, necessarily no. It can damage you, it can injure you, yes, but kill you, probably not. Now this one is really interesting to people who don't actually own tarantulas, because when they hear it, they're like, what? Will a tarantula explode if dropped? Yes, that is 100% something that can happen. If the abdomen is too big, if you drop that tarantula, it's very possible that abdomen can just explode. And that's the end of the tarantula. So this is typically why people who ever do rehouses have a big abdomen, stuff like that, they'll do it on the floor. And they, it's kind of also why if you have a big tarantula with their abdomen big, it's kind of like you don't want to feed them too much because you don't want their abdomen to explode. That's why some people are like, you should stop feeding a tarantula because their abdomen will just implode. Now, uh, the next question is, will a tarantula eat its own malt? Um, yes. It's not a guarantee, but it's something that can happen. It's same with uh, tarantula babies. If a mother has their own eggs, she may possibly eat them. It's kind of just the way of nature that kind of how it goes, and that's why most people usually take them out. Other people are like, let's let nature take control, let's let let's, 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 the mother like go ahead and do the motherly things. It needs to be done. Some others, they take it out and um, to prevent the babies from being eaten from the mom. So yes, people the tarantulas can eat their own malt, it's very, very possible. However, I have not experienced that myself with my own tarantula. And the next one is, will a tarantula eat a worm? Yeah, yeah, most likely. <laughs> it's very possible, they eat almost anything. You give them a bug, they'll probably eat it. Uh, they are predatory uh, species, so yes, they most definitely would. They would eat anything that comes in their tracks, and if they stop eating, it's not always a sign of, oh, they're dying, or oh, there's something wrong. Sometimes they just don't want to eat anymore because they're being fed too much, and sometimes they don't eat because they're in pre-melt, or they just don't want to. Some of them fast. Excuse me? Hello? <laughs> Some of them do fast, and that's kind of just how it goes. They just don't want to eat anymore, and it's not a bad sign. So many trans owners have had their tarantulas not eat for several years and they've been doing fine. Now our next one is, how does a tarantula protect itself? Um, like I mentioned before, the educating hairs, they really irritate their prey. Their teeth are just insane. They will really, really bite you and it's just in- their venom can also be another thing as well. So yes, they protect themselves with eradicating hairs, they'll kick their hairs as a warning, they'll bite, they'll throw a fret posture. Fret posture is basically where it shows you like, hey, this is my territory, you should back off, that kind of stuff, and then if you don't listen, they will just immediately bite you. Some kind of give a threat posture and then they'll be like, okay, I'll kick hairs instead, but mo most often times if they give a threat posture, it's um, possibly gonna be a, a bite next if you don't listen to that tarantula. Um, so yeah, I've had, I've seen so many like tarantula rehouses where they give fret postures because that species is just uh, very easily annoyed. <laughs> so um, they just immediately end up biting. Um, but yeah, I would say that that's how they protect themselves because that's mostly what they do all the time whenever they feel threatened. Now here is an interesting one that a lot of people wonder. Um, how does a tarantula kill its prey? Well, it basically sticks the fangs into whatever it's trying to attack and it will pulse venom 
through the vangs and it will just basically paralyze whatever it is and um, eventually slowly kill it. That's basically how it goes. Some others actually web up their prey before actually killing it. And kind of like a spider, it webs up its prey and then decides to eat out of it. They don't actually eat like the corpse itself, they eat just the insides, like kind of like sucking it out like a vampire basically. Um, so yeah, they just use their two fangs and they dig it in, insert the venom, and then it makes the prey easier to suck the blood out of, and that's basically how they eat them. Now I hope that was um, an interesting video for you guys. If you do like the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any other questions for me that I'll answer to. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been me and the budgies up here. <laughs> They're just chilling. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Bye!